and welcome back everybody it's been a while since i've seen you guys we have been busy at home sorting out a couple of things so we haven't been on the air uh, all that much but today is heritage day or more commonly known as national Bride Day. so everybody is out today brian i'm busy driving down the main road and one day when they invent smell -tition, i will make sure to let you smell what it smells like driving down the road smelling all these good uh, fires that are going wood fires and it's already it's one o'clock in the afternoon and you can already smell that people are on the go with their bras it's amazing so i'm off uh, this morning to go and get us some meat we're going down to the local butcher wood and butcher one of our favorites in terms of the meat the selection the quality it's just amazing then i'm gonna take you along with me and then when we get home we are going to prep clean up and we are going to have our own little Friday celebration we are going to have all the traditional South African uh, Afrikaans fries we are going to do meat we are going to do sausage uh, we are going to do salads we are going to do fry brokies we are going to chip and dip we are going to do the work so I'm looking forward to it it turned out to be a beautiful day in Cape Town today sun is shining I thought it was going to be overcast but it is absolutely gorgeous so just smell it, it smells so good So apparently taking you for a ride along was not going to happen inside Boot and Butcher because I got told, sorry, no um, no cameras, no photos, no filming allowed inside the store. So, sorry, but um, what we did manage to get was a nice sirloin on the bone. I actually was looking for a lacquer tomahawk, very less for a tomahawk steak, I haven't, have one. I haven't had one in ages. But anyway, we managed to get that and some biltong. So looking forward to throwing these on the fire a little bit later on. Right, next stop to get the vegetables for tonight. And this is why Lindy does not send me to the shop by myself because I ended up getting everything. So we got our lacquer steak, we got our voice, we got mom in the background over there. Hi, mom. Hi. <laughs> yes, mask mandate is still a thing here in Cape Town. But anyway, so we're gonna have a lacquer bra. I've just messaged a guy. I am thinking and hoping that we can have a wood bra uh, tonight. But as it is National Friday and everybody's wanting to buy uh, the bride today because of bride day. I don't know that anybody's got stock, so I'm waiting to hear from them. But so we are going to do some bride pop. Mom, we may need to come and find out from you how to make that because I've never made. There's instructions on the back. Okay, so there's instructions on the back. This comes out like a mealy meal porridge, something or other. We're going to make some sauce to go with it. Chips, dips, cool drinks. We are sorted. We are ready to have an awesome bride day a little bit later on. I don't know where Mrs. Bauer is. I think she's hiding away from me. But anyway. Let's get cracking. So I'm on my way to pick up our bra. I managed to find one. I'm on my way there now. I really hope it is exactly what uh, these Facebook Marketplace guys tell us it is because you never know. Facebook Marketplace is like a lucky packet sometimes. But for those of you that don't know, Heritage Day in South Africa uh, is celebrated on the 24th of September every year. And it's really just a way for us as South Africans to enjoy the heritage of where we come from. We have so many different traditions uh, and cultures within South Africa. We've got 11 uh, official languages, everything from English, Afrikaans, Swana, Zulu, Kosa. Uh, there's a whole bunch of them and it just makes it such a diverse uh, crowd, even to the point of that the English and Afrikaans, although uh, they're all traditionally white people, um, the cultures are completely different. So today we're going to celebrate it in more of the Afrikaans way in terms of brine. We're going to put some like Afrikaans music on. We're going to have a fire, uh, all the meats and jams and everything that go with it. So it's really just a day about celebrating our diverse culture. And that is one of the beauties of South Africa is we have all of these different cultures and traditions. And it's just an absolute beautiful place to be. And talk about views on views. There in the distance we've got Signet Hill on the right, Lion's Head in the middle, Table Mountain on the left hand side and then just to the right hand side was the beach. Absolutely gorgeous. Welcome to the mother city where it takes nine months for anything to happen. But how beautiful is that? Excuse the dirty windscreen. Uh, we'll take care of that later. fire i managed to go and pick up this half barrel that i've converted into a bride it's a normal thing here in south africa um so i also went ahead and fabricated up <laughs> these little brackets i had some uh square tubing that i was, had over here so cut those up got that in there got the fire going smell a vision you've got to come you've got to come because you guys need to smell what this bride is going to smell like a little bit later on so i'm just letting this burn through just to make sure that any fumes that are in that uh, half drum burns off 
and we've got Bear on the inside getting all the salads ready. We've got Zara sitting over there. Hello, Zara. Hello. Say so hello. Hello. We've got Zara begging like any good dog should do, uh, looking for something to fall on the floor. So as soon as this fire is ready, we're going to get the fry going. another successful heritage day coming from me to you it's been an awesome evening we caught up with some old friends sitting around the fire outside enjoying the social and Lindy made her awesome bribe rookies again if you missed that one I will put in the description below uh, the video where we showed you guys what we made with chutney and all of that type of thing they were stellar but the most important part was we were surrounded with people that we love so thank you for joining us on this not so normal video but I hope that you enjoyed it. Leave us a comment down below if you did, uh, if you'd like to see more of these vlog style uh, type videos. But until next time, pick up the phone and phone somebody that you love and tell them that. And I'm getting all ph philosophical on you guys tonight, so this is where I'm gonna leave it. I'll see you in the next one. This is our video for Heritage Day. You must just carry on peeling potatoes and acting like- with my crazy hair and my- That's okay, you look beautiful. This is good for a bit of spit on your chin. <laughs>